Hey guys, Mark from Custom Dynamics. Have I got a new product for you, especially you Dyna Bros. You want to clean the ass end up of your bike, get rid of the tail light, license plate, turn signals? Here's our new product, the tail light eliminator license plate mod. Run that with our curved LED license plate frame and you'll be good to go to clean up all of this. I'm going to get started on installing that tail light eliminator kit. I'm going to remove the tail light, the license plate frame, these saddlebags, the negative battery cable, and then we'll get started on the install. In a few brief seconds, I removed all the unnecessary stuff. What you do need to keep is the screw that was holding on the stock taillight bezel. I'm going to keep that to install that our taillight eliminator with. I'm going to grab that. You notice there's a little hook on the back. Feed the OEM wire through, place that hook on the fender, set it in place, screwdriver, in the hole there, start that up there, there you get it all tight and you're good. That's the beginning of that and we'll move on to putting the wiring in for the turn signals on the license plate frame. Okay guys, now that we got the tail light eliminator on, we're going to move on to the harness part. I'm going to grab the cable tie that comes with the kit, feed it through the little ring. So, grab the harness back side of the harness has some retention clips. So does the eliminator. Slide that on there. You can plug in the harness from the bike. Now we can move on to how we're going to attach the, the wires from the turn signals and the running lights and all of that. Um, we're using the solder seal. Depending on what you're going to run, if you run the license plate frame with the lights on here, how we're going to do today, or if you want to do other turn signals that we have or whatever you're deciding to run, um, follow those instructions for the wiring color code to keep the wiring straight in the diagram. Okay guys, got all the solder seals in and the wiring done. Should look a little something like that. Get it tied up as best you can. Tuck the wires back. This is just on here for showing you purposes here. But now, once you do that, you can have your plate in and all that. What are we gonna do with those? Well, let's uh, clean this area off with some denatured alcohol. We have a little decorative cover, triangle cover piece that we are going to install. And it just covers all three holes and a little wire plug hole. And it will look a little like this. Just like so. That cleans it all up. I'll be back with the final product and you can check it out. And there it is, folks, the final product. And as you can see, it's amazing. Cleans up all the unnecessary stuff. Just a little more custom look, especially for you Dynabros. <laughs>